holiness. That's what we want to talk about today in the It's Up for Debate. This whole topic came about this morning um, because I was spending some time with the Lord and he's really been teaching me about angels and how to protect your household and how not to offend the angels to lose that protection. So I was just uh, sharing with Dave this morning what the Lord had um, taught me and our discussion led to this discussion of holiness. Yeah, really, we were talking mm-hmm. about, you know, the things that we know that we do uh, to offend the angels. And um, and as we were talking about this, it led me to an article that I had read earlier in the day on Christian Net. And it was about a book that was about holiness. The whole book was the topic of how we, we needed to have holiness in our walk. And in the reviews of the book, there was a lot of Christians really attacking the author. And it just was, it surprised me as the divide. And then we get led to this whole topic here um, of it. And so we just started seeing this, is is this rift about holiness. It's a very sensitive topic. So we've come up with three questions for you. The first one is, where does holiness fit into our lives? The second question is, should we as Christians who are saved by grace pursue Holiness, is that something we pursue? And then how does that holiness conflict with grace? Yeah. So basically, um, we wanted to open a can of worms here. That's the whole point of this. Because we really want to talk about this because we see it as a rift. And we want to know what you think. And where does it fit in your life? And have you even thought about this? So, you know, we really welcome uh, you to just... Open up on this and share with us. You know, obviously, you don't have to do a video post. Uh, down below, there's going to be a comment board and uh, also a Facebook um, comment um, um, post there. So we really look forward to what you have to say. And um, it's up for debate. It's up for debate. So uh, we we can't wait to hear what you uh, what, what you share with us. Thanks for visiting. Thanks.